Haridwar means gateway to Hari, or Lord Vishnu. Gaining Ganga's mercy here, as she rushes from the mighty mountains, blesses one's pilgrimage to the Himalayas. The Garuda Purana states, anyone who immerses themselves in the waters of Mother Ganga at Haridwar does not have to take birth again. Determined devotees immerse themselves in the purifying but icy cold Ganga. These faithful may appear to face the difficulties of this world as others do, but there is a profound difference. They see tribulations as an opportunity to surrender more deeply to their Lord. As happiness comes and goes, so also distress. Both are as temporary as a leaf boat floating on the divine waters of Mother Ganga. Since time immemorial, an Abhishek, the bathing ceremony of Ganga, is performed each evening. Although offerings differ according to the means of the worshiper, the focus is always on the devotion with which the offerings are made, for this is what Ganga Devi accepts. From the other side of the river, the ceremony appears like birds of fire, dancing for the pleasure of Ganga. the greatest devotee of Lord Vishnu, is present everywhere in this holy city. His legendary power belies his matted hair, ash-covered body, and tiger skin dress. He is called Nilakant Blue-Throated because the poison he drank to save the universe turned his throat blue. Forgoing all bodily comforts, Lord Shiva lives on the peak of Mount Kailash, high in the Himalayas, where he constantly meditates on Lord Vishnu. Crossing the bridge to Rishikesh, the plains of India give way to foggy hills and lush greenery as we move ever closer to the Himalayas. Here, it is easier to withdraw the senses from worldly distractions and turn them inward toward the eternal self.
yoga, the powerful process of cleansing the consciousness to gradually reveal one's identity as a spiritual being. also achieve supernatural powers called cities, such as the ability to travel great distances using a sacred river like the Ganga as a conduit. The Ganga runs from the feet of Lord Vishnu at the topmost point in the universe down to the lowest planets. Simply by dipping in her water at one point, a yogi can travel thousands of miles to any destination along her course. However, if such yogis do not seek pure devotion to the Supreme Lord Vishnu, their contact with Ganga is compared to the bathing of an elephant. After cleansing, the elephant rolls on the ground and throws dust on his body. Although Ganga removes karma, yogis seeking only mystic power create new karma, which further binds them to the material world. Rishikesh is the home of many famous yoga ashrams or monasteries, like the enchanting Parmoth Niketan with its orphanage and boy school. Students here practice yoga, study Sanskrit, and as part of their education, daily worship the Ganga. from the sanctuary of Parmarth out into the world, these young men may one day become ambassadors of their ancient tradition. <laughs> 